Hey guys, before this video starts, I want to mention that I got some birds. They're pretty cute. They're little budgies, so yeah. You probably just saw my budgies. They're super cute. I haven't heard them chirp in a while, so maybe it'll be chirping during this video. I'm not 100% sure. Just ignore it. Um, also, the lighting. I don't know if the lighting is going to be like, you know, glowing or something like that. It happened with the last video, so sorry about that. Um, but anyways... <clears throat> I want to mention that I have a free Discord cook group, like I always do in each video. Um, this is going to help you with early links, uh, raffles, information, a lot of good things to help you increase your chances of copying really rare sneakers or really hyped up sneakers too. Um, before I start this video, I actually got my highest in the room, Travis Scott uh, vinyl. It's been months since I ordered this. I ordered this back in October and I just got it today, February 4th. So yeah, it, a, a lot, a lot of months went by, and it was like 18 bucks uh, with shipping. It was like 12 something plus shipping, so that kind of sucked. But it's pretty cool. I don't know if I want to sell it or I want to keep it as a collectible. I might just keep it as a collectible if it's not selling for that much, um, because before it was like at 100 dollars, but now the price dropped to like 30, 35, which is not really that well. And I would rather keep this instead of making like 15 dollars profit. Uh, enough of that, guys. Let's get into today's video. So today we'll be talking about the new Air Jordan One High UNC to Chicago. Let me tell you some background info. So Michael Jordan, the famous basketball player, everybody should know him. Uh, he eventually left North Carolina to pursue success at the professional level, landing in Chicago before claiming six world championships. This colorway commemorates MJ's path through two celebrated basketball communities by blending their signature hues. A base of black leather is complemented by overlays of powder blue and gym red. But yeah, these are super clean. I am trying to get a hold of these and I know a shop around my local, you know, city that will be getting these. but. The quantities are limited, so hopefully I will be able to cop. I do have school on the day, which really sucks, um, and it is a first come first serve. There's no raffle or any reservations, so you really have to be by that door at like I think they open like at seven in the morning, and I get out of school to like eleven of the morning. No, I get off of school like at ten, so that sucks. So these will be releasing on February thirteenth on the Nike sneakers app for one hundred and seventy US dollars. I'm not so sure. Or else they release um but like i said the store i know around is a city gear so if there's any city gears i'm pretty sure that they will be getting them also check the sns as video apps they always be having those raffles and also like on full lockers and champs but i'm not 100 sure they'll be getting them but you know you always want to make sure uh, check on those apps next week uh, so you don't miss out on any of those and resell i was checking on StockX a few days ago and yesterday they were like at 300 dollars average 290 you know they're making some good profit for sure i would definitely go for these i don't think these will break like the other air jordan um chicago's but they're pants and leather so they did look like kind of clown shoes that might have you know decreased the value i actually was successful but it really sucks since I couldn't really sell them, so it was just a brick. And they haven't gone up in battle either, so that sucked. Um, but yeah, if, if you think, if you're on the brink, should I cop them or should I just, you know, leave them? I think you should go ahead and cop them. There is a lot of heat coming, like the Strange Loves SBs, uh, the new Air Jordan 85s that are coming out. Um, and it's all really close. Also, the Travis Scott shoes, um, those SBs are rumored to release on February, like the end of February. So that's another drop uh, that's going crazy. And there's just a bunch and a bunch of shoes. And uh, I'm going to try my best to review every single one of them. But, I mean, if they just keep adding and adding, it's going to be kind of hard to do that. Um, but, yeah, if you guys really want me to make a, another shoe review... Uh, just leave it down in the comment what shoe I should review next or like what resale prediction, you know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, with that being said, guys, I think that's going to be it for this video. If you have any questions, any comments, um, any information for people who are watching, don't forget to leave it in the comments. Uh, also, the Discord link is in the description. So yeah, um, I'll see y'all later.